Hey guys, it's uh, Andrew from Australian Gear Addict and uh, just here with a, another product review of a military spec loader bag um, from a US manufacturer. Um, anyway, this is a, a full spec military loader bag and, and the reason why we sort of kind of uh, got it in was just to kind of, I guess, review the actual quality of the product itself. I and mean, we heard lots of good things about it and, and really kind of wanted to kind of assess this uh, kind of within its own right. And um, one of the, the big grabbers for us was uh, this particular product was, uh, was usually retailing at about $520 US uh, without posting and, and it's been sort of dropped down to uh, $250 uh, US so um, you know there's a great sort of buy opportunity for uh, people in Australia that want a you know, bag that will last them forever. Now the other thing that we're doing is we're also sort of forming a kind of little buyout group so you know if um, or a little buying group I should say so if anybody's kind of interested in, in sort of acquiring stuff uh, from the US and you know uh, doesn't want to pay those massive shipping charges on their own or wants to find ways to get that stock a little bit cheaper you know come in uh, join our buying group and um, you know when we've got, got enough people uh, and enough orders in place uh, you know we can get it at not only at a better rate but at a better shipping rate as well so we're in sort of discussions with these guys um, we're sort of negotiating getting these uh, these items uh, you know anywhere between uh, I guess 150 and 180 US so um, you know that's a pretty significant difference by comparison to um, the $500 $20 recommended retail rate but uh, let me talk about the bag um, this is a full uh, military spec uh, uh, loadout bag. Uh, it's effectively uh, one meter wide over here and um, it's 500 millimeters or 50 centimeters that way and it's 35 that way. So um, just to give you some context over here in regards to how deep this thing is, that, that's a pair of uh, military boots. So if I put that down here like that you can clearly see um, that this is a pretty deep bag and it's a pretty big bag. Uh, oh, I'm actually astounded by it because, uh, you know, you, when you think about a metre, you, you don't really kind of put it in context to what a one metre bag or a one ten metre bag would look like. But just to kind of show you the difference, I mean, over here, we've, we've got a set of, of you know, of, so it, it's a barbell, you know. So, um, I mean, look at the size of the bag next to the barbell. It is just enormous. And you know this <laughs> this is a great bag for anybody who's who wants to kind of lug stuff around, especially in the back of the four wheel drive or you know in their trunk. So you know if you're a, you're an outdoors guy or a camping guy and you you want to kind of load things on you know in, in and out, um, this is a perfect way to to, to keep all your stuff organised and um, you know secure. So anyway, let's um, let's get into the features of the bags. So you've got the dimension. Um, in regards to capacity, this is a 165 litre bag. It is just, again, enormous. Um, it comes down with these um, compression straps. So if you're carrying lots of heavy stuff, and let me get that microphone out of the way. Um, if you're carrying lots of heavy stuff, you can cinch everything down. Um, and then you can keep that secure. At the top over here, you've got a basically a, a map or a document holder that'll that'll fit an a4 page um, nice and easily for you um, there's no little uh, i guess identity or document window come down here and um, the guys also give you a um, nice little um, security lock as well so you can lock the bag up with so that's nice and handy so let me just show you actually the uh, security zips over here so, and, and just look at the quality on the, the build and stitching over here. Those zips are just absolutely, absolutely solid. Just really, really well constructed bag. And of course, as you'd expect, because it's mil spec, they're all metal zips. You know, they're not going to break real quickly. Um, yeah, they're pretty solid. So I'll just, I'll just open this up and show you the inside. So um, when we open up this particular bag, I mean, what you got over here is just an organizer's, organizer's dream, really. Um, 
you've just got web pockets everywhere. So, you know, you've got these huge web pockets on this side. Three of them smack bang in the middle. You know, you can carry all your uh, outdoor equipment or your personals in it or whatever you want to really carry in it. And on the inside of this, you again, you've got some more web areas for you where you can, you know, just store your equipment again. Just a very, very highly organized area. So, you know, you've got some in the front, you've got some in the back, you've got four of those web pockets and um, you've got these dividing walls as well so they're really handy and they're all velcro to the side so if you want to move them around or take them out you can do that so you can really kind of shape you know the bag to kind of suit your own needs another little great thing that comes with the bag as well is it basically it comes with the um, basically a soft case pouch area and you can probably carry you know a 12 or 15 inch laptop or your ipad or any other sort of electronic devices you know, I've seen some uh, some video where mill guys or guys in the security industries have, you know, put a couple of guns in there or handguns themselves uh, in there or taken the whole lot and, you know, put in all their um, all their tactical gear and chest plates and all that sort of type of stuff, uh, you know, if you're, um, if you're in the uh, security or, or armed forces. Um, so in regards to uh, other features, um, talking about pockets um, there's two large very very large pockets on the outside again so double steel zips that come in massive absolutely huge you can get in there um, they're roughly uh, I think it's like 40 centimeters uh, in in length this way and they're 30 this way and they're seven inch deep so you know you can really store like a lot of stuff in there you know it's really really handy to have all that storage externally as well and uh, believe it or not, there's, a, there's, there's another ultra long, you know, pocket on the outside uh, um, of the bag as well. So this one runs all the way along the outside and, and, and you know, this is perfect for, uh, you know, if you want to carry, you know, a single or a double tent, you know, some of these sleeping bag systems, you know, other stuff that you do really kind of don't really want on the inside of your bag, you know, I mean, it could be, uh, God knows, I don't know you know cooking stuff or whatever you know who knows but uh, i mean if you're using it uh, as a you know um as a as a normal person um you know this is just a, a great storage and 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 you know travel bag where you can carry all your outdoor equipment in um you know and and just you know you know have it so you can sort of kind of wheel it around you know with these chuck it in the back of your car chuck it in the back of your boot and you're, you're ready to rock and roll um Absolutely kind of fantastic bag. Now just talk very quickly about the construction um, of the bag. Again, so just having a close look at the stitching and the materials here. I mean, this stuff um, has just been so world crafted. It is a great piece of work. And I tell you what, for half the price that it was retail, it was worth every cent. Oh, I'm just extremely happy uh, with acquiring one of these bags and um, highly recommend uh, you doing so as well. So let's have a look at some other things as well. Now all these side walls of these bags over here, uh, they basically take foam inserts so it's, you know it's relatively sturdy. Um, on the back of the bag is the base of it is made out of kydex and um, all these rollers are again a kind of solid plastic kydex material and, and then you kind of got rubber wheels with bearing on there. And uh, a very, very nice touch again, just to go to the quality of the manufacturing of these guys is that any area that's kind of exposed to uh, potential, you know, wear and tear and being roughed up is, is all reinforced again with, you know, with PVC. I mean, just even in these corners over here, you know, so they've, they've really kind of thought about this bag. And, um, you know, there's a reason why there's, you know, initially a high cost to kind of associated to this product. Um, because it's just so well engineered. This is just a great bit of kit. Um, look, if you're, if you're interested in effectively getting involved the, with the buying group and, and um, getting some stuff in for cheap for yourself, uh, get in contact with us. Uh, if not, uh, that's cool too. And I uh, hope you 